Hello everyone and welcome back to another weekly vlog. Me looking like this. I've got half a face of makeup on. I'm just doing my makeup and I thought I would start the weekly vlog here. How is everyone doing? Today is Tuesday. I didn't start the vlog yesterday because my Mondays are very boring for the vlog. I literally do work. I filmed also my pamper routine. So my hair's feeling nice and soft. My skin's feeling nice and soft. It's just a good soft day. I don't really know what I've got planned for this week. I'm not doing much today. I need to go to the post office. I need to go see a friend quickly. On Wednesday, I don't really have anything planned. Thursday, I've got an event. Friday, I'm seeing Tash all day because she's back down. And then I have no plans for the weekend. My Traeger's piercing is like really hurting and it's like bleeding i think i don't know what's happened to it but all my piercings just love to get infected or have something wrong with them i hate my eyebrows i just want to get microblading but i just can't be bothered at the same time and i have no money how's the job hunt going you say oh it's great actually i found a few jobs yesterday that i'm going to apply for today i think oh one last thing how cute is this black phone case with a little heart pop socket very cute, very cute. I'm all ready, all ready to get on with work, really. I'm actually getting my lips sorted out and a top up in like two weeks max, I think. Not even that, maybe. I, st I need to actually book my appointment. So I don't know if you can tell, but this side has got a lump and it's bigger than this side and there's a bit missing here. So basically, I'm going to go and get her to sort it out and look, you can see it in this light. It's weird, but you can't necessarily see it in this or can you? I don't know. But yeah, I'm going to go sort that out at some point, which is exciting and also have a top up. <laughs> I'm buzzing. Um, I spoke to the woman about it and because I actually went to see her about my lips as like a checkup and also because of the lump that I have. And she basically said that bruising can also move the filler about and like this bit bruised a lot. And basically I, cause I went there to see if she can fix the lump and she basically said that I can either take the filler out and then put it back in or she can just top up like around it for now or just leave it for eight weeks, let it settle a little bit more and then she can fully sort out my lips with like a normal top up as well and i basically asked her like what is going to be the most beneficial for long term because i don't want to start messing around with my lips at all i don't want to just have like a quick fix do you know what i mean like i can deal with a lump like it's it's not the end of the world i would rather make sure that my lips look good for the future and i don't start messing them up because she really didn't want to do my lips in the first place she was like you've got really nice lips like the shape of my lips were really nice apparently she was like i don't want to ruin them she took so long doing them um, she's really lovely. She basically said to leave it for eight weeks and then she's, she can sort out fully with a top up, everything. And that'll be better long term. So I was like, okay, yeah, that's fine. Post office time. Oh, thanks. Packages are in my boot. Oh my God, I really need to clean my car. It's actually filthy. There's a McDonald's bag in here. There's some drinks. Ooh. It's actually so warm today. I don't even know. I wish I was living in one of them houses in there. There's like a little inside road and it's really cute. It's like closed off. But no, I live on a main road. The guy in the post office is definitely starting to recognise me. He was proper like, oh, hi, you're back. I was like, yeah, just returning some more parcels. He was like, huh. I was like, I'll be back soon again. <laughs> don't worry. That's my life. They're gonna start to hate me. Pot noodle time, I reckon. Is it pot noodle time yet? Yeah, we'll Food just makes me tired. I might just have a coffee and see how I feel. We should leave the live doggies out in the garden. Go on in. It's really weird. I don't know if you can hear me over the kettle. Soz. It's really weird. Recently, I've been very on and off with food. Like, I had a few days where I constantly felt full and I constantly just wanted to eat. And then now i'm like i'm hungry but like it's because i'm bored and whenever i do end up eating i don't finish anything and like i just don't have the biggest appetite at the moment for food i go through these stages all the time so i go through a stage of like eating so much and i go through a stage of not eating much and then i go through a stage of like being really healthy and like eating reasonably well normally i use a gray one of these but they are sold out 
in my supermarket and they've been sold out for like a week. It's doing my head in. So my mum bought this one. It's not actually too bad. Like it's not creamy or anything. It's not as oaty as the Alpro oat milk, which is kind of good. And I think they all cost the same now. So I might start getting this. I'm just going to sit down with a coffee and probably continue doing some work. I'm back down here. It probably doesn't look any different. It probably looks like I've done nothing. You probably hear the kettle. I'm making a pot noodle. I'm so tired today. Again, I can't seem to wake up. I think it might be because I need to move, but I have left the house today and I'm gonna leave again in a bit, a little bit later. My parents are actually going away again for just over a week works out. Exactly nine days they're going away for. Very excited for that. Quite like being home alone as would anyone. The only annoying thing obviously is I have to look after my dogs, but they're all right. They're tiny little things. I'm gonna take this upstairs with me. Oh, wow. Well. I've had two coffees, can you tell? Oh, my wardrobe door's open, meh. It looks like I've pretty much been in my room all day, but I promise you I haven't. I went to McDonald's and saw a few friends, you know, had a bit of a chill time and stuff, you know, as you do. Popped into co-op, got some energy drinks for tomorrow because at the moment I'm really obsessed with the monster energy drinks. I know that's really bad, but I really like them. And now I'm here. So I have left the house today. I have left my room. It's just, I was gonna car vlog and then my tripod was just not having it. And I was like, great. And then obviously when I'm like with friends at work, I can't vlog. But anything that I can't really vlog, I do put on my Insta stories. So go follow me on Instagram and then you'll see kind of, everything really what i do um anything that i don't put on here is pretty much on instagram and anything that i put on instagram no anything that i don't put on instagram is basically on here so get the best of both worlds you know but i think i'm just gonna end the vlog for today and uh i'll catch you tomorrow Good morning <laughs> i feel like deaf today i've just made myself a coffee and i saw the dishwasher was ready so i quickly emptied the dishwasher i'm such a good human i actually have an event today which is exciting i'm nervous but excited at the same time it's in london it's in shoreditch so i need to go there by myself and then get back by myself apparently it finishes at nine i think i vlogged like once yesterday so i'm not even gonna bother putting it in because it's so pointless but basically i just did a lot of work yesterday i edited my weekly vlog uploaded it like it's all done and dusted i scheduled my boots haul that is ready to go up i did like a little rearrangement of my videos you know when you just kind of like go through your plans and stuff i did loads of work oh i wrote a blog post about my hair that's exciting that will already be up by the time you're watching this so i'll link it down below it's all about five it's about five products that saved my hair job hunt is going fantastic i'm getting jobs left right and center i'm getting quite a good response from the 24 hour challenge video the the one that me and becca did people are liking it which is great oh 1721 followers subscribers even i gained four last night that's exciting thank you so much for subscribing because i was quite scared that people would be like not watching it or people would be like oh it's such an old trend now but i just wanted to do it because it looked really fun i actually won a competition but this brand was working with like a load of different bloggers and stuff which was really exciting which is how i saw them and then i like followed them and they're like running a competition and you had to like comment i think they had you had to comment what your favorite coffee is or something and i did because i was like why not let's give it a go and i won so this is the Cam kambuka Cam kambuka i think that's how you pronounce it um little like thermal mug thing look how pretty and it's actually really good so it is quite small it's only 300 mil but it's fine because that is the size that i wanted so it would like nicely just slip into my bag i'm like not strong but basically you unscrew it obviously to fill it in fill it up whatever and then you have three buttons here um which you can either lock completely so it doesn't spill you can unlock so then every time you press this button you can drink or you can fully unlock where it's just constantly open see mine is on constantly open right now but it's from yesterday i wanted like a thermal mug for so long it literally came at like the perfect time i'll link the brand down below they've got some really cute designs i've been chatting too long i'm gonna go i'm just getting ready doing my makeup i'm doing like a little bit of baking because I need this makeup to last me a long time. That's what I'm doing. Wow, that looks well harsh on camera. I will blend that out. 
at some point i'm just gonna do my e-brows first yeah, i'm just getting ready so that i'm all ready to leave whenever the event is at six so i think i need to leave about five ish something like that and my trains i'm on like the southern line which is the worst line in england so that's always fun yeah the circle's quite good isn't it i didn't watch it last time i wish i did i might watch it at some point when i don't have anything else to watch catch up on what happened in the first one but yeah it's quite good it's quite interesting how it's so easy to catfish but you do end up like getting caught and you're like ah. so it just teaches you to never catfish people i feel like i'm a catfish when i do my makeup though I can't believe how organised I've been this week. I think it's because I haven't really done much this week. I've just been like working. And obviously I've been doing a lot of filming and stuff. Which is nice. I'm all ready. I think I am actually going to wear this jumper with a pair of jeans, some boots. And then I will have my red bag because it's the only bag that I have that I actually like. So the red will kind of add a little bit of colour. I don't know if it's put a red lip on as well because I think that might add a little bit more of like a... Hi. I'm knackered though, but I've got the caffeine shakes because I've had too much caffeine today. So that's just what I want. So I done my makeup a little bit different. I added like eyeshadow at the top here. Can you see? Oh my god, my eye looks well weird. I don't know if you can see, but um, kind of like to give the look of eyeliner because I can't really do eyeliner and I don't want to mess up my makeup because I don't really have the time to like redo it all again if it goes wrong. Oh, what I did last night was I drew a plan of my room and how I want it to look like. I drew what this looks like right now and how I want it to look, what this looks like. I drew out this, oh, hello, this area, what I want it to be looking like and then above my bed and stuff like how i want my prints to be and do i want anything above my computer and stuff so then i've got like a rough plan of what i want i'm struggling with the shelf under the tv so that's probably going to be the last thing that i change first thing i'm probably going to do is this wall behind my bed because it's just completely empty so i'm going to get some prints some frames spice it up a little bit because i feel like my room it's like just a bit meh, you know. I'm nervous about tonight, but I'm also really excited. It gets me out of the house. There's something a little bit different. I've told myself that I'm going to stop saying no to events unless I actually can't go. Like, at least I... Unless I actually have a reason of not going, I'm going. Whether I have to go by myself or with someone else, I need to go out there, put myself out there, meet people, be more confident. Because I seem like I'm confident and I can be a confident person. But there are certain things that I do really, really struggle with. And one of them is going to things by myself i hate it that's my little ramble i am now watching the latest episode of the circle which is episode 14 i think right now so i'm just going to finish watching that then do a bit more work and then go and leave so i'll catch you in a bit hi everyone it's friday friday yes oh i'm so out of breath i did vlog yesterday but I don't know if I'm going to put it in or not because it wasn't that much. The same with Wednesday as well. Um, Wednesday I'm definitely not putting in. Thursday I'm not sure yet. Well, I'll see when I'm editing. I was meant to go to an event yesterday. But long story short, I literally left to go. And then the trains were all messed up. Which meant that I was going to be late. And I couldn't be late. So, good focus. Thank you. God, that is really unattractive lighting. Yeah, because of the fact that the trains were all messed up, I couldn't go. And I was so annoyed. So I literally went to work, did work, got a Chinese, cheer myself up. Standard. Oh, I'm ready. I'm going to Blue Water today. I'm seeing my best friend, Tash. I haven't seen her in a while because she's moved. You should probably know this by now if you watch my weekly vlogs because I would not stop talking about it for a while. She's down here, so we're spending the whole day together, which I'm very, very, very excited about. We're going to go do some shopping. I mean, I'm going to do window shopping. <laughs> get a starbucks probably like always then we've got toby car rebooked for 7 30 i think so it's gonna be a nice good busy day and i can't wait yesterday i felt like shit i'm not gonna lie i was so gutted about the whole event situation so annoyed with the whole situation so today's a new day though it's all about positivity the way they make these tops is just so dumb this is like bearing in mind i've got quite big boobs this is still really loose. I'll try and vlog as much as I possibly can, but you know what I'm like when it comes to blue or I end up forgetting and then and then that's it. And then I come back and I'm like, I've had a really good day. 
but I need to vlog because I haven't really vlogged much this week and I'm actually doing something rather than just being at home all day. Right, I'm off. Who am I? I love John Lewis. I can't wait to be rich enough to shop in here every day. <laughs> yeah, no, it's really good. I like that. Uh, I'd get all my tech stuff here as well. Yeah. Their guarantees like really good. Really good. Yeah, I got my um, lap Apple laptop from here. Yeah. I think my first one's from here. Where do you want to go after this? Mm -mm -mm. Cute. Uh, 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 uh. Is that Shakira? I don't know if Shakira done it. Yeah, yeah, she was in Zootopia. Man, that's sick. I'll let you in on a little secret. Right, so you know the Tash, you know the sofa's over there? Yeah. That's where my photo, you know, on my Instagram. Um, the photo of me sitting down with the Primark bag in front of me. <laughs> it's literally, I sat on the other side of that sofa. <laughs> so Pandora was in there, but I like got rid of the Pandora name. Oh, no, that's not dark chocolate. It says dark. No, it says milk and dark. What? Yeah. I don't understand. And it's vegan, so. Oh yeah. How much are they going to be though? Eight pounds. Uh, yeah, eight pounds. Oh no. Yeah, no, eight pounds. Don't know if I can afford that now. We're all done. And one lesson learnt today. Oh look, these are the boots. Oh yeah. Oh, they're cute. One lesson learnt today, kids. Halloween in England is shocking. We don't celebrate it. Oh my god, my yogurt is getting squashed by the pumpkin. I need to go to America for New York next year. I need to go to America for New York next year, yeah? Is that what I said? Yeah. <laughs> I need to go to America for Halloween. You need to go to New York for Halloween. New York for Halloween. Yes, because it's shit in this country and it's disappointing. Halloween's the favorite time of year and there's nothing about, so America it's gonna be. Now we're just gonna go back grab a drink and then it's Toby car free which is exciting the light in here is quite nice proper flattering oh, <laughs> damn okay I am back now I don't know if you can hear me or not but god I really it really annoys me that my glasses reflect everything I'll take them off yeah I'm back home now it was really good we went to Toby's after um so I got lots of food obviously I didn't eat like a Yorkshire pudding or anything with cheese but actually I can eat quite a lot in Toby's so that's fine I'm off I'll see you tomorrow morning good morning it's Saturday today I'm just getting ready for a day of filming that's kind of it that's kind of all I have planned I think I'm seeing Becca as well at some point I think I'll be going to hers tonight but I don't know what time I'm excited I'm filming my very first Halloween video I don't think I've ever done a Halloween video before if you have got any video ideas for me as well like let me know because I'm scared that I'm doing an extra video a week. I'm going to run out of ideas and I'm going to be like, I don't know what to do now. Like, I've done every video that I want to do. So let me know. And I don't know if I to do Vlogmas or not because I feel like Vlogmas really takes over your channel and there's just like a massive overflow of videos. So I don't know if I should just stick to my weekly vlogs like normal or do Vlogmas. I don't really know. I don't know what to do. I'm also planning to sell my Olympus camera but the only thing is, is, which is really annoying, I've lost the flash to it, which I feel like no one really uses flash nowadays anyway, but it's the f like it will downgrade the price on it because it's missing a piece. <laughs> it's just so annoying. Unless I can find it, but I honestly don't know where I would have put it. I, th I think it's been lost for years, but I want to sell that camera anyway. I don't use it. It's literally been sitting over there for like two years now. I haven't used it, so I should probably get rid of it. It's a really, really good camera and... If I was more into photography, then I would keep it, but I'm more into like video stuff. And I feel like for the photos that I do take, I don't need a camera. Um, my phone is good enough, or I can always take photos on this camera as well. So I'm kind of lost a little bit with how I should have my blog because I wanna introduce, I wanna go back into more beauty on my blog. Um, just every now and again, post like my favorite pieces or like things that I've discovered that I love. Um, not like full, fully on like 
bombard the place with beauty or anything. But obviously, sometimes I do want to take like a little flat lay. Um, I don't have anything for flat lays anymore. I used to have loads and loads of stuff back at uni when I used to take flat lays and stuff, but now I don't, and I'm like, I literally have nothing. But I've been filming for seven minutes. <laughs> I'm gonna go. I'm all ready. And all I want to do is just lie down on my floor and chill and not do anything. That's literally what I want to do right now. I need to tidy up my room at some point. <sighs> I really can't be bothered. I haven't started my video yet. I'm about to do that now. I don't know if I like this lipstick. It's too pink. It's really pink, isn't it? I might need to put a bit of a nude on top or something. Because I basically want to find a really good everyday lipstick. And I can't seem to... I think this is a red. Yeah. Why have I never worn this before? Um, it looks like I have, but perfect for this time of year oh yeah just using the lid to put the lipstick on why am i so bad at putting lipstick on gorgeous color though mm, loving it i've been feeling emotional thinking about you thinking about you babe what can we focus on the truth cause i don't want to see you with somebody else and i've been feeling lonely in this king size bed i'm trying not to worry about the things you say I ain't got the time. <laughs> this is fun had a bit of a mare because none of my batteries have been charged properly so i sort of half charged this one put the other one on so it should be all right i always have one battery fully charged i must have forgotten that I actually used that battery before and didn't charge it and then like put it in my bag. That's what's happening today. God, my battery takes so long to charge. I'm just packing my stuff to go to Becca's house, which is exciting. I haven't been at house for ages because she was working some really awkward hours. So I didn't get to go on Wednesday night like I normally would. So it feels like it's been a long time and it feels weird, you know? You know when you're just like used to something and it's part of the routine and then it doesn't happen one day and you're like excuse me i'm gonna try and see if i can car vlog actually i'm gonna try and fix my tripod in my car wow oh, this lighting is just so good see if i can car vlog for a little bit because i haven't done it in a while and i miss it it's just my tripod keeps either falling off the windscreen or it's just not the right angle and i'm like what are you doing so i'm gonna try my best to fix it but i'm gonna leave now because it's time to go and i'm really cold i might even put a scarf on because Ooh, it is freezing i need to sort my car out at some point as well because it's filthy and there's a lot of different shopping bags in there but there's no point of me taking them in whilst my room is a bit of a mess and i haven't sorted my clothes out of my room yet having a mare having a mare guys right i'm gonna catch you hopefully in my car if not at becca's it's raining a bit heavily so i'm actually not even gonna try and vlog because you won't really be able to hear me like it's not raining that heavily right now but it's supposed to be raining all day like the whole journey and if it gets any more any worse it's just gonna be annoying so i'll just see you at becca's hi i'm hi. with becca <laughs> i love that like quick switch i was like wait what is going on this is why like filming like a um like a challenge video is really hard because i'm like vlogging and filming at the same time yeah it confuses the brand yeah but I'm filming the, well, you already know, I'm filming the Halloween challenge. But I'm at Becca's. I didn't vlog in the car because it was raining. And this is what it's currently looking like. Watch the video to see the rest. Promo. <laughs> yes. What we're gonna do now? Uh, clean up. Oh yeah. <laughs> Sorry, mom. Make oh my God. <laughs> you know, they look like, you know, you sometimes get like a green potato like a little crisp sometimes you get like an odd like green potato crisp what do you think oh no i've got a massive bit i don't i like, like them yeah are they really strong no i need a bigger bit we love each other <laughs> Oh, they're not too strong for me. I feel like they're the right level for mm. me. 
There's like times where I'm like, oh, that might shoot down my nose, but it doesn't. Because it's not spicy though. It's just wasabi. For some reason, it's got that kind of like bacony aftertaste though. Can you taste that? They're nice, mm. but they're weird. Mm. Perfect with beer. What about wine? <laughs> they're kind of addictive. Yeah. Mm. I like them. So in the last weekly vlog, I mentioned that Becca joined the um, Alex Draw Club. There they are. There they are styled to perfection. Yes, they look cute. Just, and then this is my side of the bed and the bedside really table. Moved your bedside table over. Ruined it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Basically, we're moving it to the wall, which oh. will be interesting. Also, can we point out that she's got a photo of everyone else in her room apart from me? Have they seen your massive? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to say the one. Yeah, no, it's like, I don't want you to edit it's it. It's a PG I... channel. <laughs> oh, yeah. Shit. Right, so you need to push and I need to pull. Right, that's about. Well, it will go a little bit further, but at the moment, can you pull that extension cord on the floor closer? Oh. Right. Oh, we're not moving this side of the bed. We're just moving the top. Oh wait, no, it's not against the wall now. Oh, I'm confused. Oh, I need, I need to get there. <laughs> wait, how are you going to pull it? Well, no, we'll both push and hopefully it will work. Yeah, that will do. Perfect. Yeah. This is so much filming. Hi. We made the soup. We're we're eating it. If you want to know what we if you want to know what we think of it, go watch the video. <laughs> Triple plug. <laughs> I'm doing so much plug in. Jesus. Um, we were we started telling. Well, we nearly told a story on there, and we decided. Well, Rebecca reminded me that it's a story for the vlog, not for the video. Ooh. I'm a thoughtful friend. <laughs> oh. Why? We were talking about going out and how we only make friends with like ten year olds. <laughs> Ten's a bit young. That's like younger than your brother. <laughs> True. Well, more like younger than just people younger than us. Yeah. And that's like on nights out as well. And we pulled seventeen-year-olds <laughs> by by accident. We didn't actually do anything like don't arrest us. But there's also a debate about whether that's legal or not. You don't yeah. want to know. <laughs> I'm not getting into that right now. It's a bit too deep in my pumpkin soup. Mm. You also need to do your story time. Mm. Mm. I'll be there for moral support if you need it. I feel like I might do that when I like have a job. <laughs> so then I won't have to come back. <laughs> well, everyone's left now, haven't they? Mm. I need yeah. to do it. There's a really, really interesting story time that I would really like to tell. Basically, she was stupid. And that that's all of the story of game. <laughs> I did something naughty. I was naughty. wild and young and free. It's not from a song. <laughs> Young, wild, wild and free. We were walking to O'Neill's, where we live. Or near where we live. Actually, nowhere near where we live. <laughs> <laughs> we don't live in the area we go out in because all of our friends live in the area that we go out in. Anyway. <laughs> we were walking. And these two boys, what did they first say when we, when we were walking? We were like walking. And they literally shouted like, oi oi girls! And we were like, oh, here we go. Here we go, fun fun. And then, how did they, like, oh, I think they were, I think they were just like, oh, how old are you both or something? And we were like, how old are you? And they're like... That's our go to. Yeah, and then they wouldn't, like, tell us. And then we were like, well, we're 23. And they were like, no, you're not. And they didn't believe us. No, we didn't tell them. They told us first. Oh, did they? Because then when they said, and I was like, yeah, oh, I'm yeah. like old enough to be your mum. They were like, oh, what are you trying to do? Yeah. And then, you know, when like taking the money out and stuff. And then they were like, mm. I showed one of them my ID. And they, didn't and they still, still didn't believe that we were 23. Nah. They were like, no, you're definitely not 23. Why are you lying? Blah, blah, blah. I mean, do they know that you're 23? I don't know. Do you know that I'm 23? <laughs> Leave it in the comments. <laughs> Guess my age. I mean, I already said that now. <laughs> oh, I was, I think, no, I wasn't. I was going to, basically, one day I want to do, like, um, a McBang to do with sex and relationships. Because I want people to guess my body count. Do you know how old your audience is as well? Um, 
Apparently everyone's over 18, but that's a lie because you have to be 18 to make a YouTube account. <laughs> I mm. think I'm like 28 on Facebook. Classic. Mm. Bebo. Oh, if I haven't turned that oven off. Oh, Bebo. That was Good my Bebo. jam. It's closed down now. Oh, yeah. I used to really like just looking at my profile for memes. Yeah, all the memes. Oh, I remember my background with dancing pandas. They were like, boop, 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 boop. In the background. No? Did you ever have that thing like... You're like younger, oh, younger baby, but baby with like two eyes and a double E, and you had like a, a street name. Mm. What was your street name? Angel boobs. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I, I have no idea what, what mine was. Like angel and then the boobs, guess how I spell boobs? BBZ. Mm. Mm. There's no other word, way to spell it. Nope. Angel boobs. That was my string. It's like one. baby, you've got to have it. It's like BBY. Yeah. Or BBIIE. Or... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, why were we so cringy when we were kids? Yeah, I think I'm done. I think I want Daredevil by it, so. Yeah, like, I don't. It's, it's too much. I feel like you can't eat a lot of this because it gets quite sickly. Are we meant to cling film it and put it in. I mean, I wouldn't eat it. Later. No. <laughs> but then I'm like, do I throw that in the bin? That's going to be really messy. Toilet. Oh my god, you're a genius! I always um, put cereal in the toilet if I don't finish it. That or like makes porridge. So much or, sense. Yeah. Wow, I feel like I'm just like an adult hack for life now. Then flick my mum for that. Flick mum. <laughs> <laughs> they don't know that either! <laughs> just beep it all out and then you can be like. I'm gonna have to cut that because I wanna like do like a. I think I said it earlier as well. When you watch for it. Yeah. Now they have no idea what we're talking Ooh. about. And they're gonna wonder. Ooh. Right, we should probably go because we're chatting so much shit. So we got KFC. Went to the draft through. Had the weirdest thing, right? This guy was like hugging the like voice so machine. Weird. And we were sitting there like, have you locked the car? Like, <laughs> what's going on? It was the weirdest thing ever. And the KFC looked well old. We went to Lakeside, didn't we? Mm. Yes. So I'm gonna end the vlog here and I'll see you tomorrow.